My name is Michael Magistro, and I'll be showing you how to manage your passwords using KeePass, an open source software program that allows you to manage your passwords in a safe encrypted database uh, that is user friendly and easily searchable. So let us begin. So the first thing you're going to want to do when setting up KeePass is go to keepass.info. Um, then you'll go to the downloads portion of the site and click and choose I like the KeePass 2.17 uh, the professional edition you can choose the classic edition but this tutorial will focus on the professional edition which is also free so I've already downloaded the file so I'm just gonna go to my downloads folder and install the file from there Now, this is the KeePass wizard. Once you choose your language and get past the Windows security stuff, you'll click Next, accept the agreement, and just in install the core files. Click Next again, and just click Next again because these are automatically selected. The desktop icon and associate KeePass files with the KeePass program. And click Install, and then click Finish and Launch KeePass at the same time. This screen shows up for me because I already have a password database, but I'm going to press cancel and I'm going to create a new database. So I'm going to go file, new, and then create a database in the same name that I had before, and then click save. Yes, I want to replace it. Master password will be teddybear10, and you can click these dots to make sure it's right. Click OK click OK again. If I want to add a new email address under the Mike's Passwords group and in the email group I'll click Add Entry and I'll type in Bob Smith at, or Bob Smith Gmail. Username is Bob Smith 50210 at gmail.com. Now I made this email earlier for purposes of this tutorial and my password is Teddy Bear 20 and the URL is gmail.com now click OK now my file has been created now to access my gmail account I'll click this file and then down to the right here it says gmail.com I'll click that URL link and it will take me to the sign-in page of Gmail. I'll go back to KeePass and I'll click my password file again and I'll press Control V and that will automatically type the, the username and password into the file for me. I didn't even have to type that. Now let's say that you want to change your password. You click your profile and click account settings and then you'll click change password. Now my new password, I'm going to use a special password. I want a password that's really complicated that would be really hard to crack. So what I'm going to do is go back to KeePass and click Generate a Password, Generate Using Profile. So I will double click it and select it and copy it and then I'll go back to Gmail and I'll press Control V and then Control V again and click Save. I will sign out of Gmail and I'll even exit the page. I'll click OK and then go through the same steps I did. Click the URL, go back to key pass, press control select the file and press control V. It'll automatically log me in into Gmail. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial on using KeePass to manage your passwords.